Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is a barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of uh, excitement and expectation. It is a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. To what we've been told, this is how it looks. It's a 4 3 3. Yeah, and the two wide players up front can make the system pretty much succeed or fail. They'll be quite flexible in their creative movement. They like to drift in. At times, they'll mix their game up and, and keep their width. And of course, they're also expected to track any runs from opposition fullbacks. So they've got quite hard working jobs. But if they can gain a one on one advantage, they can dictate. Got things on the way. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Yeah, Riyad Mahrez. He's one of the best dribblers around, Peter, with such delicate close control and, and wonderful balance. He could finish with the best of them too, so I wouldn't be surprised to see him score a few cracking individual efforts for this team. He loves to move in from that... Up he goes! Corner and he did the rest. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. Manchester trail at this early stage. How will they respond? Both teams boast a perfect record a couple of games in. That has to change now. Sterling is fouled. Zinchenko. Gundogan. Cleared away. Werner absolutely focused then on the defensive side of his game. You have to admire commitment like that because he could easily ignore that. Has a pop! <laughs> two up, too easy. How many more to come? The lightness of step, the sharpness of movement, the certainty of finish. Werner showed real composure then. I mean, how often do you see a player do everything right until he gets into the box, only to completely kind of fluff the finish? Not him. Chelsea take a two-goal lead, and things should be comfortable from here on in. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. Conte. Chilwell goes on a charge down the left. Lukaku hits one! Chelsea are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attack in heaven.
Chelsea take a three-goal lead and they are romping out of sight. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. And it's Gundogan. And here's Mores. He's in! And the counter is on. He's got through. There really wasn't very much in that. Not far away from being a telling final ball. Chelsea just had to make the ball stick, but came up short. Goes for goal! And that's off target. Manchester are really feeling the strain now. Impatience has taken charge. Sterling. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Well, the ref's been lenient here. I doubt he'll get too many more chances. And he just whacks it away. Lukaku with good energy in defence as well. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team really, your striker should be the first line of that defence, and, and he's delivering. Zinchenko. And that's been levered clear. And more than happy to take the muscular approach. Good ball. Lukaku. He's on his way. Shoots. It's come back. And in it goes. Surely now they are well and truly out of sight. Aderson reacted well to the initial effort, but couldn't get it right out of the danger area. Well, look, regardless of whether the keeper could have done better or not, Peter, that was all down to the excellent movement in getting into the right position to apply the final touch. Chelsea tear their opponents apart once again. They are utterly ruthless. Gundogan. Laporte plays it forward. Sterling desperately wants to get on the end of this. Oh, that's clever. Shade too heavy. People can pick that up. Rodri. Promising, but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. He ran himself into trouble there, free kick given away. And that's going to be a booking. Ederson gets it upfield. And it's played forward. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Hoists it forward. That's a throw. And it's Zaya. And the finish! That's past the post. Look, it, it was achievable, Peter, but it needed his best. Yeah. 
De Bruyne. Laporte. Laporte goes looking. Uh, ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. Laporte does well there. Alert. Forward it goes. De Bruyne. And it's got through. The referee has given a corner. De Bruyne plays it short. Zinchenko plays it in. And out it comes again. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. And he's not played the ball, that's a foul. And he is going into that little black book. That's not the ball he wanted. De Bruyne. And he reached half time. Well, oh, that flew by. It was breathless stuff. It's been one way traffic here after the first 45 minutes. A relentless barrage that looks set to continue. Chelsea have been more or less perfect, I would say. Their manager's all smiles, and he's got every reason to be. Chelsea have been nothing short of awesome in the first 45 minutes. A truly memorable performance on all counts. And it has to be said, this match is well and truly already won. We're probably into the second 45 minutes. Conte turns and goes back. Zinchenko just did a brilliant... And he certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. Keeper sends it forward. Stones gets into the right position to intercept. That's a promising ball. Going through. And a header! No joy, but a decent try. And it's Zayek. Oh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Look, he's offering an apology to his teammate, who's clearly miffed at not being picked out despite making what looked like the right run. And they win it back again. Now it's Lukaku. Yeah, he was under pressure to get that exactly right, and he couldn't even think of the consequences. It was instinctive and rock-solid. Laporte. It's a long pass, but not the most accurate. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No, it's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Goes for goal! Oh, he really got hold of that. Well, they're being made to force the issue, but they need to be patient and, and a little more composed. Manchester making consecutive changes here.
Raspilicueta. Zayek. He's through. Stones positions himself well and cuts it out. Kyle Walker. Stones drives it forward. Rodri. He's played him through. Shot a goal! It's anyone's ball. Oh, that is asking for trouble. That intervention was very necessary. A real chance to break. De Bruyne takes control of it and he's on the move. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. to meet it oh, that's why chill well some good play on the left hand side now to profit from it and it's Mares. And here's Sterling. Jorginho battles to win it back. And here's the chance to counter. Laporte. Mares. Bernardo Silva. Mares. Finds himself eased off the ball. Jorginho tries to get it forward quickly. They've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. And he's going to have his name taken. Well, sometimes a loose foul can trigger a completely different spell of play and uh, it makes even less sense. Time for a change in personnel. Gabriel Jesus. Rodri. That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Rudiger tries to clear. Oh, smart save. Lukaku tries running with the ball at his feet. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Uh, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. And it's Marcos Alonso. <laughs> Foul and a free kick in a very dangerous area. He knew what was coming. That's a yellow card. That's another dead ball chance. So he's plotting something before playing it in.
Laporte can get it clear. Saul. Big chance! Well, the first goal came from this. Hefty challenge, but fair enough. Laporte gets rid without sophistication. The changes then in quick succession. Yeah, I just think that's really good management, introducing one of his younger players when the pressure's totally off, just allowing him some valuable, easy on-field experience time. Shots to cross here. Worst header in the world, but nothing comes of it. Mondi, and it's Sterling. De Bruyne, Gabriel Jesus, plays it out to the wing. Here it comes. Marcos Alonso. Now it's Mares. Gabriel Jesus. And it's been taken straight back. The ball's come loose and the chase is on. Saul. Saul plays it forward. And here's Zayek. Shapes to shoot! Oh, impressive strike. Done very well to intervene. Pulisic. And here's Luke. And the shot! He's put it wide. Everything went for them, their poor opponents left chasing shadows. A scintillating performance. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? Chelsea certainly ran a perfect race from start to finish. Out of the blocks quickly.